Hey everyone, it's Nikki again. I'm going to show you guys how to do individual microbead extensions. Um, this is Nicole. She has pretty fine hair, so we're only going to use about a hundred strands, but if you had a client with normal to thick hair, you might want to add 50 more or even double it and make it 200 strands, just depending. Um, what I do here is I take a bead and I wrap it around the hair using the tool and then I use um, a piece of the high quality hair that she's holding and stick it inside the bead and then clamp it shut and it holds in place. It lasts about three to six months depending on how fast your hair grows and how good you take care of it. Um, it's good to use leave-in conditioners and heat protectant products on it. It takes about three to five hours to put in and the cost just varies because there's so many different types of hair you can get. You can get normal quality, medium quality, high quality, but um, if you want to see how much I charge to do this, you can go to the website which will be at the end of this video or it's hothairextensions.net. Because Nicole has fine hair, we're going to only use 100 strands on her, but at the end of the video I will show you how it looks with maybe 50 more strands and I'll curl it so you can kind of see the difference on how much thicker it looks with more strands and how pretty it looks when you do curl it. So this is how it ended up looking with 100 strands of hair and it matches really good with her hair because her hair is so fine. It's about 18 inches long. You can move your fingers through it and you don't see anything. It can blow in the wind and you won't see anything. It's really easy to put it up in a ponytail because they're pretty much not visible. And then we put in 50 more strands just so I could show you what it looks like. So it's 150 total and we curled it so you can see the different things you can do with it. You can use heat, you can wash it. Same thing you do with your normal hair, just be a little more gentle. 
And then there are some before and after pictures so you can see the difference.